Well, Keegan, Chief James Davis was, Police Chief James Davis was in the hot seat. He said he believes the state's open carry law is leading to the crime on the streets of the capital city. This is how Jackson's special Friday city council meeting on crime got started. I can tell you, uh, you can see crime is down in Jackson. And I see kind of the, the discomfort in people's face when the statement is said that crime is down in Jackson, right? Because it doesn't feel that way. Chief James Davis told the council Mississippi's open carry law is to blame for gun violence in the capital city. Everybody wants a gun and we have no grounds to police guns or question. We know the people with guns. The chief didn't say the gunmen in the city's 10 murders so far this year were operating under open carry, but he said he believes the state's liberal gun laws restrict police officers. I will be violating that right if I walk up to them or any police officer questioning my gun. If you have a weapon and you're going to open carry, you still have to check in yes. uh, with that law enforcement agency. And that's something that we need to look at. Uh, putting on the books as a law. What are we doing to disrupt the flow of illegal guns into the city of Jackson? Just last year, we 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 uh, worked up 92 cases with felony firearms. Some council members suggested police officers should get a pay raise. Because for me, I want a well-trained officer who receives adequate pay for their services. Mayor Lamuma met with Governor Bryant to talk about how the state can help the city. Bryant, you'll remember earlier this week, pledged $4 million to help fund a new center to monitor crime in real time. Live in the studio, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.